a real destination. You know, it's an absolutely gorgeous building and it kind of suits what we try and do, which is real honesty, uh, rustic, hearty sort of food. And it's kind of like, you know, that sort of robust sort of macho building, you know, with a sandstone. We've been in this place now for about two years. Uh, we opened up Balzac um, six years ago in a previous premises. The idea when we first opened up Balzac was, you know, to bring good food to the sort of the masses, you know, without trying to sound like a hippie as such. I mean, I think from the age of 10, I'd always wanted to be a cook. And I went to work for, without doubt, the most influential guy in my uh, food cookery. And that was a guy called Philip Howard. And he basically threw everything I thought I knew out about cooking out of the window and just introduced me to this real modern sense of food. Right, so the dish that we're going to present is truffle infused fried quail's eggs. So what we've done is we soft boil quail's eggs and then we panay them so we make a schnitzel. We serve it sitting on uh, three little commas of uh, celery puree uh, with a little ragu of sautéed diced celery asparagus and some girolles. We show the quail eggs which are absolutely gorgeous and we finish the dish off with some uh, freshly shaved Margaret River truffles. And these flavours work. Celery and truffle, eggs and truffles, asparagus and truffle. These are classic marriages that have been done for the last hundred years. Once you actually kind of put them in your mouth and taste it and, and the egg pops and you still get a beautiful, lovely, runny yolk goes in and just all marries and works very, very well. It's like having a sort of deconstructed sort of omelette. You don't have to be spending 60 bucks for a main course. If, as long as you've got someone who actually understands how to cook good cuisine, you can eat it at reasonable prices, and that's what we try to achieve here. The idea is you get a whole package without having to pay three hat prices, that you don't have to be of the elite to eat really good food, and that, that's what our main aim has been. What I think is, is, is lovable about it is the fact that it's uh, honesty on a plate, honesty in the service. It's a place where they can come and relax. You can either come for a big night out, or you can come and just sit in the corner and chill out. You know, we do work bloody hard to put that food on the plate. And I think that that really comes across in the food. It comes across in the service. These guys do work hard to, to look after their guests. And, you know, that's something that people, you know, really, really enjoy. They, that, they, they kind of warm to that.